There are those who question the tort system, that it is A, designed to help lawyers a lot, B, that it takes too long, and C, that it sets up this idea that we are compensated in dollars. Surely there's something more to making people whole than a check. I, I, I haven't seen it. <laughs> if you go back to the founding of our republic, money has always been part of the compensation mechanism. There may be countries that barter or a thank you is sufficient or uh, you know, we'll work in, the f in your field to make you whole for three months, something like that. The capitalist system, from Jefferson and Hamilton right up to the present time, compensation is the mechanism and the courts are the vehicle. And when I hear people talk about tort reform and the, and the lawsuits and litigation and lawyers, I have two reactions. One, the litigation system in this country, the tort system, works pretty well. Not perfect. The parade of horribles, you can, you know, we know what they are, medical malpractice and mass torts, and there are problems, like any system. But I think overall, day in, day out, thousands and thousands of cases in this country are resolved through a tort system that I think works pretty well. Secondly, very important, even if you think the tort system doesn't work that well, you're tilting at windmills. If you think you're going to change the tort system in this country or the way we resolve disputes, that system is so ingrained in the fabric of our country, it's, been, it's so much a part of our history. You may be able to, to modify it, you know, around the edges, but it is, I think, a permanent feature of the rule of law in this country and, it, and, and it's not going to be modified.